Now, remember the outcry about waterboarding? Sure. You know, everybody jumping up and down. Yeah. Uh, NBC News, I thought they were going to, like, melt down over there. Mm -hmm. You heard anything on NBC about the drones? Not yet. No. And I don't care. Uh, okay, okay. My job is not you, to be here no, defending I don't look, the NBC. Just, if you want to pick out, pick out of yourself. No, no, no. It's just you and me having a little discussion. All right, you here. and me having a little discussion. Okay. You think they right. suck for not doing it? I, I'm not, don't, I don't care one way or don't another. Don't put words in my mouth. Okay, let's just right. continue our chat here. All right, let's chat. All right, so you haven't heard anything over there about this, and then neither have I. I don't watch Neither has my staff. Okay. Okay, okay so we, we haven't heard anything. But we heard a lot about waterboarding, but nothing about drone strikes. How do you process that? I have no interest in processing no, whatever but she does. does it. You know, well, you're an intellectual guy. Intellectual <laughs> curiosity. Intellectual curiosity. You know, you, Why would just, they go crazy on waterboarding and, and they don't care about drugs? Look, there are people. I have no idea. What you I don't do. know. I'm not the editorial. Hey, why am I supposed to know what NBC does? Just an I opinion. I have time figuring out what you do. Beckle, just an opinion. An opinion. Right, my opinion. My opinion yeah, is yeah. that they probably should. Everybody should focus on drugs. Yeah, why aren't they? I don't know. You don't know. Bill. You don't have an opinion. I have no idea. No Do you opinion. have an idea? Yes, I, have I know no why. Idea. Why? Because they're protecting the president. Oh, I see. They're protecting the president. Yeah. Well, fine. If that's what that's, they're doing, that's why they're doing. That, that's what you think. And that's look. I but just that's don't what care. it is. I don't care. You don't care. Okay. Now, some people regard death by drone as a necessary evil of our post 9/11 world. The way we have to do business against an enemy we can't see, including sometimes Americans who have switched sides. Others see the use of drones by the United States as nothing more than execution by air, without due process, no court, no charges, no trial, and relatively little oversight. What's beyond dispute is this. Drone attacks have become a huge weapon for this country, and this president has made unprecedented use of them. NBC News has obtained a government document that lays out the legal argument to justify the president's use of drones to kill al-Qaeda suspects including, in some cases, U.S. citizens. Our national investigative correspondent, Michael Isikoff, broke this story and has our report. Brian? Michael Isikoff, who broke this story in our D.C. newsroom for us tonight. Michael, thanks. And finally tonight, the factor tip of the day, more deceit from the far left. For 17 long years, these loons have been trying to marginalize me. They failed. And even though their attempts are extremely tedious, they continue. They have nothing else to do. Now, last night I talked with Bob Beckel about the difference in analysis on the subject of waterboarding as compared to killing people with drones, a policy President Obama embraces. I put forth it over at NBC News and other media places. They were hysterical over waterboarding, but muted over President Obama's drone attacks, at least until yesterday. Immediately, the far left machine cranked up. O'Reilly didn't say that NBC News broke the drone memo story. He's a deceiver. True. I didn't say NBC broke the memo story because we weren't talking about that. Waterboarding versus drone strikes. But once again, we have a propaganda campaign designed to make ignorant people on the left even more ignorant. Factor tip of the day, don't deal with loons. I have to... You shouldn't have to. You heard anything on NBC about the drones? 